Hey there folks, got a new knife for you. As you could tell by this mini little fake pelican case. I don't even know who makes this, but a lot of knife makers are now putting their knives uh, like um, NCC Knives uses this, uh, Sharp by Design uses this, but this is a knife from Russia. This is from Atropos Knife. You know I'm a fan. If you saw my last video on his uh, large balisong the Cali's mercy so i told you guys in the last video that he does a bunch of uh, other balisong types he does the trainers and he does the micro uh balisongs and this is one of them he had a bunch of these available in different uh, iterations he added in green anno blue anno purple anno they had this gold anno with a little bit of hint of pink in it and he did a bunch of treatment and this one has it. It has this uh, customization on it, this uh, which I'm sure he used a Dremel all hand customized like this rock pattern. He also milled out holes on the handle. This is a titanium build. This is a channel construction. Uh, overall length on this bad boy is about six inches. This is a small Balisong drop point blade D2 steel and just this gentleman just makes some beautiful beautiful grinds the blade uh, length itself is about uh, I think two and a quarter it's not very big at all not very big at all but he had different versions of it uh, different um, steel uh, blade designs uh, I think he had like a Tonto and um, maybe even a sheep's hood but uh I actually asked him because I couldn't design which one <laughs> was what I would what should I buy and he said he recommended this one and I did this one is a um, Zen pin construction as you can see no tank pins so the pins are built into the handles which is my preferred uh, pin selection for ballys I just it just makes me feel like it's uh, more durable in construction because it's screwed in there right instead of just being press fitted in the tang i know that fast bandit brian loves the tank pins maybe because he's a a ballad song aficionado and you can see how small this sucker is it's pretty pretty small now the name of this one is called the kirat which um the gentleman named it after himalayan mountain he seems to name a lot of his knives cali's mercy i think is also himalayan based so and again, it's channel construction. You might even see the when he drilled the holes that you could see that there's some, uh, you know, cutouts over there in the handle where the drill probably touched the sides. So one piece channel construction on the titanium. Some beautiful anodization. He contoured the blade nicely before he did this uh, rock pattern. So fit and finish is pretty exquisite on these ballys. Like I said, he does trainers. I think the prices are going up, folks. I think I bought this for like two fifty, and I seen his knives are going up. Um, maybe because he's getting more popular. But you can see how beautiful the anodization is there. You can see some pink, and then some gold. His logo. Just a cute little bow song. Very nice. Just to show you, give you a size comparison, I happen to have the Cali's Mercy here. Let me open it off screen because I got my camera pretty low and you can see, get an idea how much bigger the knife is. Big difference. <laughs> but um, yeah, pretty pleased with this. Again, it came from Russia. This one took about 17 days. That one took 15 days. For whatever reason, this was a little bit delayed. I always get nervous when the knife doesn't get to me sooner. I'm, you know, I'm like, I don't know if it's getting stopped at customs or it's getting stolen in Russia. Who knows? But just some beautiful hand customization on the handle there. That's uh, pretty, pretty cool. I think he's doing inlays now. I think he did a bally with an inlay that might have been like an open bid or um, 
or a, a lot of, I'm not sure, but he's definitely doing a lot of work. He also had this, like, these small uh, micro battle songs in that finish, which was a little bit more reasonable, a little bit cheaper. <clears throat> but you guys should check him out. He's blowing up. Reasonable. Very reasonable. Beautiful hand finishing. Just a gorgeous knife. All right, guys. Short vid. I think I'm going to do an outdoor vid for the my Instagram people. But uh, I figure I'll do this one. So, yeah, nice look at the finishing work and the coloring. I'm not sure if the color will translate well outdoors. But so I wanted to do one for YouTube so you guys can see how cool this is. All right, guys. That's uh, Atch Post Knife. This is the Karat, his micro bell song piece.